And good evening, my lovely Lost Tales, and welcome back to the Blue Rose Respite for my Friday Night Spy stream. After years of waiting, we finally get to sink our teeth into Resident Evil 4 Remake. Thank you all so very much for joining me tonight, guys. Um, we already have an amazing hype train just around the corner, but a big thank you to Barnum's Odyssey for your 24-month resub for two full years now. Thank you. Wait, two years? Where did that go? It seems like yesterday was a year. And it's been two wonderful years having you as part of my community. Thank you so much. And a big thank you to Samwell as well for 32 month resub, another month of being subscribed to the most wonderful, effortlessly beautiful and talented streamer ever. You make my Fridays vibrant with joy and full of love. If the weekend was a person, it would be you. All the love and hugs. Thank you so much, Sam. <laughs> thank you both so much for your resubs. I really appreciate it. And Hayden, thank you so much for the 38 month resub, a tier 3 sub at that. Thank you so much for over three years of support on Twitch and across numerous platforms. Thank you so, so much, Hayden. Oh, but you guys are absolutely amazing. And I am very, very excited to sink my teeth into this game tonight. I was trying to post um, my announcement that I was going live on my YouTube community page, but for some reason it's not letting me upload my picture you know I'll just post the announcement anyway it's being weird maybe the picture is too stabby <laughs> guys oh my god we've already got a hype train going Oh my god, you guys, thank you so much. Um, Barnes Odyssey for the gifted sub to Snake Sosa. You're amazing. Thank you so much. Guys, now is a perfect time if you want to renew your subscriptions. Now's a great time to do so. Um, renew your subscriptions if you want to like drop bits and all that good stuff. Now is a fantastic time. Please don't feel pressured if you're not able to. It's all good. Just having you in my chat is more than enough. Thank you. Sucks that it wouldn't let me um, post a picture. Mm. So I was really proud of the picture that I took uh, for this evening's announcement. <laughs> but thank you all so much for joining me tonight as we sink our teeth into the remake of Resident Evil 4. Now, just a quick heads up. Full, full confession time, I have not played the original Resident Evil 4, so I do ask if you have played the original, and even if like you're further on ahead in the remake, please, no spoilers. I mean, at all. There's some stuff I'm familiar with out of context and from like memes and stuff, but in terms of major characters other than Leon and like President's daughter, really, I have no idea about any of like the major plot beats or anything like that so please uh mods be on the lookout even like wink wink nudge nudge kind of comments please refrain from doing so because i do keep an eye on you chat just to make sure you all behave yourselves <laughs> but thank you so much toby loomis for the 100 bits happy friday everyone and happy friday to you as well toby thank you all righty guys without further ado and yes, Dork Souls, I have seen the announcement about uh, the second chapter of Coffee Talk coming out. Okay, let's just go standard, and then I'll put on trainer wheels mode if I need to. Oh, thank you, Sam. I appreciate that. I'm really pleased with how my eyeliner came out tonight, and like the look that I put together for the pictures. This is fine. This is fine. Hope you're ready, guys. September 30th, 1998. It's a day I'll never forget. The cop inside me died that day. Mm. That night, Raccoon City was wiped out, thanks to the bioweapons created by Umbrella. Somehow I made it out, but too many others weren't so lucky. 
I was asked later to join a top secret government program. Not that I had a choice. Oh, Leon. Training. Punishing missions. Nearly killed me. But at least I kept my mind off everything. Hi, Logan. How's it going? If I could just forget what happened that night. The pain. Even for a second. This time, it can be different. Later. It has to. And then nothing bad happened to Leon ever again. So tell me, Yankee. Why did you come to this horrible place? As close to nowhere that I've ever seen. Let's just say, looking for someone. That someone must be very important, then. Huh? The chief gave the orders himself. Help him, he said. I'm sure your boys didn't come all the way out here to roast marshmallows. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he did. I like he's still got his sass. You have a strange sense of humor. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. Just between us. A lot of people have gone missing around here. And it's been that way for a while now. Mm. Well then. Should be just another day in the office, right? Mm. I mean, last week there was a search for some missing hikers. I'm sure you'll do your best to help me. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys, for the level 2 hype train. You're amazing. Thank you so much for the bits and the subs. I think this is it. Nature calls, huh? I'll be right back. ¿Te has bebido el bar entero? You smoke? Hmm, danger senses are tingling. Vaya sitio más tétrico. how people die <laughs> aren't you aware you're in a horror game <laughs> oh thanks for the stretch check hey didn't sorry didn't notice that before <sighs> he sure is taking his time did he fall in maybe you better go and take a look oh watch the car wouldn't want to get a parking ticket. So much for helping me. He's a policeman. He had no chance in a horror game. And to be fair, Leon is an ex-cop and now he's like special forces. So that makes me nervous. And yes, I, I saw people's comments of like, oh my god, this game looks absolutely amazing. Also, keep in mind, I'm playing it on like massively reduced graphics levels so that then it was like smoother like frame rate for you guys. Um, so honestly, if you're playing it on your own and you're not streaming it and you're able to bump the graphics up even more, it looks even more amazing. Nah, Leon is a super cop. Yeah, he's a good boy. Carmina, thank you so much for the 30 month resub. Good luck with the spooks and kooks. I will do my best not to die. Okay. How far could he have gone? I still like moving slowly because I like taking in the atmosphere. And I'm cautious and nervous. And yes, Android, it is my first time playing, so no spoilers. I am very much enjoying seeing how this ride unfolds. Oh, come on. Anything you 
eso no okay it's still being a little tricky so I might go into settings and just adjust a couple of things just before we get too far into the main game come on come on there we go Just because I know when the action picks up a lot, then uh, it's going to be a little bit more processing power. So I was hoping it would be okay, but I guess not. Let's just see how that goes. Come on. And yes, I did play the demo. And the, dem the, the demo had me very stressed. Crew charm, judgment is nigh. This is fine. Everything's fine. Mm. Hey, Alex Ray, how's it going? Welcome. And I need a key for that. And I don't have a key for that. Go on. I'm just going to tweak the graphics just a little bit more. Because I do like me some gore. Let's give that a try. And thanks for that snake, I did that. Come on. Sorry to barge in like this. Busco a un policía. Vino aquí.
E. No, this is not good. Officer's badge, National Police Corps, uh, Mario Fernandez Castano, police officer. Everything's fine and good and fine. And it feels like the frame rate is even weirder at the moment, so I'm just going to try switching that back to the way it was before. Because my PC isn't terrible, it's... and I don't know why it's... oops. Yes, I did update my drivers right before um, the stream, and I did restart my computer afterwards. Okay, hang on. Everything's good and great and fine. And I know that OBS takes a chunk out of my processing power, but it shouldn't be this much. Yep, everything's fine. Okay, with it, because I assume after that bit it automatically saved, I'm just going to quickly jump back into the main menu, see if I can mess around with the graphics again, and then go back into the game, because, I like, Village was fine after a little bit of tweaking, so I don't know why this is being a bit iffy, but maybe it's just, like, launch day trickiness. Launch day swings and roundabouts most likely. Yeah, I agree, and I'm not sure why it's being a bit iffy for me, but I assume it's probably launch day trickiness. Oh, that really looks like shit. Hang on. Let's see if you can find some sort of balance.
these. Okay. Not perfect, but should be okay for now. At least it'll be smoother sailing. What was that? At least for launch day, hopefully. Mm. No fucking way. Gross, gross. Fuck off. Everything's fine. I feel like we'll likely get a patch for this. I imagine we will. There's always like a couple of hiccups with uh, day one hiccups. Okay, I'm going to try and be quiet. Because, yeah, at the moment, this is freezing up every few seconds for me. While it adds tension and all that, it's not the best experience. Oh, yes. Our old friend, Green Herb. Yes, please. Please. Come on. Under one. Hunnigan here. What's your sit rep? The president's daughter, Baby Eagle. It's likely she's in this village. Our intel was correct then. Well done. Need a location on a nearby lake. She may have been taken there. Copy that. I'll see what I can find. Hurry up. Something's happened to the people here. My escorts are. <laughs> Gotta go. Talk later. I'll let myself out. This is fine. This is good and great and fine. I do love it that Leon still has plenty of sass, even though <laughs> he's in a a horrifying, terrifying situation. Then again, when is he not, though? Worry if I mess around with too many things that's making it worse than it actually should be. Let's drop that down to 60. Uh, Dork Souls, yes, I do take recommendations and then I put them onto a list of recommendations that I currently have, uh, or recommendations and uh, requests, and then I check them out to see if they kind of fit the sort of vibe of uh, the streams I like to play, the games I like to play, and then I uh, consider it.
Yeah, Captain Badass. Okay, just because the freezing up is genuinely driving me up the wall and it freezes up like every few seconds for me. Um, I've kind of turned off all the major things. So honestly, unless you guys have recommendations to how to have it somewhat balanced, then I'm not sure how far I'll be able to get in this game. Saving an item storage, you can save your progress at any time prior to. You can also swap out weapons in your inventory via the storage menu. Good. Because, like, it's freezing up even when I go in to use, like, the menu. Which it really shouldn't be. <laughs> and it might just be day one, um... Uh... Wheels and roundabouts and all that. Yes. Beyond trying to see if there are any background processes that might be sneaking resources, I have no idea. Sorry, that's okay. Um, what I might do is, um, if you guys are cool to just chill for a second, I might put the BRB screen on, just because I want to see if I can like do any more tweaking to try and get it at least playable, because I am have a feeling the action's going to be picking up very soon and if it's going to be freezing up every few seconds it's going to make it this an absolute nightmare for everyone so i'll be back in just a moment Okay guys, I'm back. Um, I just lowered the resolution a bit and tried to balance it out a bit more, so this should be smoother sailing. Hopefully. I'm also putting it up to it being like first day, early patch and everything like that will be welcome for next week's stream, but so far... Oh no! Puppy! I'm sorry. And it's so cute that you guys break into a little dance party. There we go. Okay, yes, this is already running a hell of a lot smoother, so... 
Hopefully it won't be too much of a headache going forward, but fingers crossed, guys. Honestly, like, early stages in Resident Evil games always have me so fucking stressed out. And just fucking run, Leon. It's too many of them and I don't have enough bullets. Fuck! Come on, Leon! Red herb. Out of the doorway. Stay down. Oh, fuck. Or not? God damn it. Okay, first death and it was only less than an hour in. Hell yeah. <laughs> okay, I still am getting used to the combat system of this game, so please bear with me, guys. No. I'm sorry, puppy. And yeah, I have a feeling I just need to get more into the flow of the combat and then it should be good. I see you. Damn it. Come on. Come on. Okay, right trigger. Good to know. Okay, I wasn't sure if it was a uh, right bumper or a right trigger, so now I know it's right trigger. I tried to avoid that, I'm sorry Leon. How you doing health-wise, sweetie? You can restore health using herbs or first aid spray. The effect of herbs can be enhanced by combining them with other herbs. Red herbs increase the amount of health recovered, while yellow herbs increase your maximum health. Oh, oh, we're going to be keeping an eye out for those. Uh, how is my health doing, actually? Uh, it's not bad. I'm gonna wait until like I really need the first aid spray like and I need a full heal. <gasps> yes. 
Oh, good. <gasps> yes. Okay. Item crafting. Certain materials such as resources, gunpowder, and knives can be used to craft different items. The types of items you can craft can be in increased by obtaining new crafting recipes. Good, good, good. Setting weapon shortcuts, set a weapon shortcut, blah, blah, blah. Okay, yes. I'm going to do that, and I'm going to heal the on. Okay, I have a total of 18 bullets. I will inevitably burn through all of them very quickly. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, what was that? Oh lovely, a severed head. Leon and the not so very good awful day. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, mate. I'm sorry, mate. Ooh, pick my voice. Deal his choice of Lady Dimitrescu or Countess Stefania to critique Leon's performance. Well... We are in Resident Evil, after all. I'm sure you've all been missing the raw majesty of Lady Dometresque. Of House Dometresque. And I must say, this village is so below my standards. I don't even- even that fool Heisenberg would find himself trapped here. I trust you've all been behaving yourselves in my absence. Someone coming. Oh. Let's wait for her to go past. <sighs> Though these fools wouldn't stand a chance if I was here. Okay, I can't stealth kill her. Here we go. Oh shit. No, thank you. I thought I would get to this a little bit sooner. You guys ready? You guys fucking ready? Welcome to Resident Evil 4, baby! Just fucking run, Leon. Keep fucking running, Leon. Of 
Because there is a snowflakes chance in hell of taking him out. And I just need to keep fucking running until I find a way to get out of here. And everyone in this village is fucking crazy. Uh, not that way, not that way. God damn it. Keep fucking running, Leon. Damn it, come on. Okay, two times, guys. Hopefully this time I'll be a bit stealthier at the start. Although I have a feeling... Lady Dominatrice would be terribly just embarrassed to be associated with Leon in this decrepit, sad little village. The one that Mother Miranda holds in her grasp is so much more exquisite in innumerable ways. Shit. These fools would not make the mistake of getting close to me. All these disgusting fools are absolutely repugnant, aren't they? And that one with the chainsaw, my, my. I would absolutely abhor such brutish weapons being wielded in my vicinity. Though, despite his formidable nature, in the end, he is still mortal. At least when compared to the raw majesty of Lady Delmetrisk. Of House Delmetrisk. Wait for her to go away. Let's give this another try, shall we? On now, Leon. Surely there's some other fun little toys we can have some fun with. Just keep running, Leon. We're nowhere near strong enough to take these idiots on. There we go, that's more like it. Oh, you gotta be 
Okay, good, good, good. Spinel, interesting. Oh, oh yes. Taking you. And we're taking you. One, I just will need to get them all bundled up and then okay I'm going to do just a quick heal just in case I get caught off guard again Like that. Damn it. Get off me. Okay, there's got to be a way out of here or through here nope damn it come on I was so close that time uh, to be fair this demo did take me a couple of tries when I did play the chainsaw demo it took me a couple of tries to get through it Let's give that another try, shall we? I just want on the record, or on my map, I should say, that I have that. Oh, thanks for the stretch check, Doc. Ah, I actually really need a good couple of stretch checks because um, uh, I woke up at like three o'clock uh, in the morning this morning and uh, I must have like twinged my neck really weird while I was sleeping but I woke up at like 3 a.m. with like this massive like spike of pain and it was just like it, it was just from like a, a, a nerve pinch that I like I jilted myself in a weird way while I was sleeping and um yeah but I just took some painkillers and I was fine uh, but it's kind of been an on and off thing all day <laughs> no that was me that was my joints Okay, I'm going to wait for grandma to go past. Okay, yeah, I think she's gone. So yes, you can do sneak attacks in uh, this game, but um, I just suck at them. Hey, 
Spirit Wolf, how's it going? Welcome back. Just trying to get through as stealthily as I can. I say that as I smash open objects. Mm -mm. There we go. Grab that. Someone coming up. Come on. Oh, sorry. There we go. Oh fuck, that was way too fucking close. I'm just going to quickly grab a little bit of healing from some green herb because no thank you okay 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 no 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 I was hoping because they were bunched up I could throw my grenade but I'm gonna loop around and then try and throw it Come on, get out of the fucking way! God fucking damn it. This is going to take me a couple of tries. I think the death count is up to four now. And uh, we're well past it, but thank you so much, Hayden, for requesting Lady Dimitrescu. This area in particular is just very, very stressful for me, so I'm sorry that the voice was a bit inconsistent. <laughs> I'm just trying to make Leon not die. 
But I feel so weak. I want to protect my baby. <laughs> Let's take care of her first. Good, good, good. I think she's just outside. Is she? I can't see her quite through the window. Uh. Okay, there she is. Keep going. Okay. Come on. And then this guy is right around the corner here. Here we go. That's more like it. Okay, that's already like killed three people as opposed to like the massive group that was before. So, ha! Hey, Dan the Man, how's it going? Welcome to the Blue Rose Respite! Okay, that's locked. Fuck off. And we haven't yet activated Chainsaw Guy. Just want to see if I can get into any of these areas. Okay. Ooh. There we go. Hi, buddy. Okay, and I can't get out the back way. Shit, shit, shit. I think I'm stuck. Come on, guys. Ah, 
No, I think I'm stuck here. I literally can't find my way through. Yep. Note to self, don't get stuck in a house. Mistakes were made and we live and learn. I was trying to run away. Okay. I'm not gonna get caught up in trying to like look for supplies everywhere. I'm just gonna try to survive the best I can. Shit. Sorry mate, this is the like the fifth time we've seen you burn alive and I'm sorry. How many of the villagers can you thin out before the doc shows up? I was looking to see if there was like a noticeable reduction in the amount of villagers, but then I also saw that they were spawning in from um, like jumping over uh, fences and stuff. So I think even if you manage to like stealthily pick a couple off before he shows up, there's still like at least, I think 12, I could be wrong. Um, but just kind of doing a, a quick count of like, okay, what familiar faces are there? I think there's like at least 12 villagers coming after you in this scene. Which makes sense because this is like the first big encounter, so it's supposed to be a bit of a challenge. So I, I absolutely get that, but at the same time, <laughs> I feel so weak. Shit, shit, shit. Go away. Away, she's going away. Stealth, 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 stealthy boy, Leon. Also, I love Leon's jacket. Like, this is the brown aviator jacket that I've been trying to look for. Because I have a really, really nice leather jacket, but I've also been looking for, like, a nice brown uh, aviator with the Sherpa fluff around it. He. go. Come on, come on, come on. Because this feels like I'm going in the right direction with this cutscene and everything. Yes. 
Managed to get one sneaky hit in, so I count that as a victory. Run, 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 run. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, good, good, good. I think I managed to get quite a few of them with that, so I'm pretty pleased with that. And now I just need to keep fucking running. Ah. Fuck off. Oh my fucking god. Okay. I don't care if I'm using all my healing. I'm. This is probably the best try I've done so far. Come on! Thanks for the hydrate check, guys. This is fine. Where's everyone going? Bingo? <laughs> Hopefully now I can at least look around a little bit. Oh? Route to Condor One. I've identified a route to the lake. Look for a large windmill. There's a path on the far side of it. Windmill. Copy that. And be careful. Roost out. I'm sorry, These mate. People are sick. 
Okay. Head for the lake. Uh, what direction is the lake? Where, about where a windmill is. Um, okay, it's general that way direction, so I think we have to go back through the gate that, uh... Oh, dear friend, chainsaw friend, uh, came through. And hopefully we can just kind of do a quick look around all the things that I wasn't able to grab before. Yes. Okay. But let us preserve that shotgun ammo until I desperately need it. Quick question, Steph. Is the plan to go all the way through Resident Evil before before returning to Control? Yes, yes, it is. Um, just because Resident Evil Four has just come out, I have been dying to play this game for a really, really long time. And then we can pick up uh, the last bit of Control uh, when we finish this game. I know it's a little tricky with like interrupting uh, games that I'm already playing, but just when um, a new game comes out that I've been like really like anticipating, then that kind of takes priority for me. Locked off. Okay. Let's quick look around here. That's blocked off. That was blocked off. Oh. Hang on. Nice. Just want to check if there's useful stuff in here. Okay, got another hand grenade. Oh, more things. Okay, got good amount of ammo. Which always makes me nervous because when you find large amounts of ammo, that usually means they're getting you ready for something. Anything interesting around here? <gasps> Herb! Yes! And I already checked in there. Let's have a quick look in here. Grab that. Yes. Because me thinks that is valuable. Okay, and I'm just gonna check. Yes. Good, good. Uh, I'm just going to... Hang on. There we go. That's better. I do need a new knife, though. Um, but I'm just going to quickly use that and save my other healing things for when I really need them. Can I go through here now? Okay, in com for com the sake of complete transparency, when I played the chainsaw demo, it took me like seven or eight tries to finally get to the point where like the title drop comes in. Um, and I am kind of glad that we got, I got a little bit of a chance to kind of practice a bit before jumping straight on into this game. Otherwise I would have just kept embarrassing myself again and again and again. I do need a new knife, though. <gasps> you 
you get eggs from the chickens? Eee. Uh, Dork Souls. No, I don't think I did. Um, what was the game that you recommended? Sorry, uh, just during that last little bit, I was a little stressed. And you keep heading around and up this way to the windmill. Road 96. Um, I'll definitely check it out. Uh, mods, if you could actually send me a quick um, at me on um, uh, the server and then I can see it after the stream as a reminder. Okay, that's oh, locked. locked. Brilliant. Stealthy way. Ooh. Herb. Ooh. More secret things for secret keys. Blue request notes. You can take on tasks by collecting the blue request notes posted around different areas. Fill the requests you've taken in. Uh, view the requests you've taken in the files menu. Destroy the blue medallions. For the love of God, uh, will someone please get rid of the blue medallions? Those religious lunatics left hanging around. Request destroy blue medallions area farm. Re uh, rewards you get some spinel. Okay, if I spot them, I'll get rid of them. Good to know there's also tripwire explosives in this game. Yay! Ooh, yellow herb. Can I? If I combine you. Uh, this blend of green and yellow herbs will restore as much health as a single green herb and increase your maximum health. Ooh, yes. Good, good, good. Okay. everything myself <laughs> absolutely Leon you've got to make your work for it because yeah we need to find a thing to do the thing so we're looking for a large wooden cog of some kind okay Before I get down there, I just want to look around here first. someone in there I I don't know where I should be bombastic and just like charge through <laughs> I see you Blue medallion. I see you do you see me do you want to come out and make this easier for the both of us Oh, 
I have a feeling what I need is in there, so... Oh, I hear something though. Hi, buddy. Okay, now that's unlocked. Damn it. Good, good, good. And you know what? I'm glad I spent my hand grenade on that. That felt worth it. If I missed firing at that, that would have been embarrassing. Okay. Now that bulk of the enemies have cleared out I could be a little less stealthy I'm just gonna save again because I have a feeling I got lucky with that so yeah I think that alerted most people in this area of this village at least so I can kind of be a little less still cautious but can don't have to sneak around everywhere and also now I can properly look for where this wooden cog might be not luck just your impeccable talent <laughs> I, I'm still getting used to the more aggressive uh, mechanics for the combat in this game um Because it's either you're s s super stealthy and avoiding uh, combat, or it's it's about finding that kind of sweet spot of, especially when you're just starting out in this game, and you have very limited ammo and uh, special things. Ooh, although I did get a nice new hand grenade. I'm just gonna quickly reload. Oh, and an egg. Thank you. Now, where would that cock be? I thought it would be in here, but I guess I was wrong. Oh no, wait. There it is. I was just so caught up in the chaos that I missed it. Ooh, Ruby, nice. <gasps> yes, kitchen knife. I'll be taking that. Oh, nice. Actually, can I craft anything with that? 
crafting material can be combined with gunpowder to create a variety of ammo and uh, attachable mines. Okay, I think I'm good. Oh, I need more gunpowder for the shotgun shells. Okay, I'm gonna wait until I have uh, some more uh, gunpowder. And then I will make some more shotgun shells. Oh wait, I haven't seen through here yet, have I? Good to know. Oh shit, I'm so sorry. Um, I've just been so caught up with this amazing game. Um, thank you so much Rosen for the <laughs> redemption of a uh, pick my voice. Well hi there everyone. I sure hope you're all having a wonderful time tonight. Not getting up to too many shenanigans. Or just the right level of shenanigans. Mm. I have to say this place is pretty freaky. Alright, quick little stretch. Good to stretch my little floppy arms. Before things get too serious and scary. No, but so long as we're all having fun, guys, that's what matters. Alright, let's pop on down and, um... See if we can find this poor girl. Hopefully she's doing okay. Although I don't like the looks of this place. All right, Liam, put your back into it. Here we go, and I think that should be leading us to where we need to go. Yeah, from the looks of things, we need to head down there. But before we get too carried away, let's see if we can look around a little bit more. Just in case there's any more... Strange and unusual things around here. Right, I think with that I can make some new, uh, useful things. There we go. That's more like it. And I will say, I do look exceptionally good in a cowboy hat, don't you think? Alright, can't get through there yet, so let's go see if we can find where she's gone to. Nice try, Bucko. It's going to take more than that to bring this Muppet down. They keep coming. Alright, so can't get through that way anymore. 
Hmm. Maybe I could go through another way. Ah, here we go. Alright, let's just keep moving, guys. Hopefully things will get better over here. And I think that comes to the end of that Redeem My Voice for... <laughs> Kermit, of all things. But thank you so much, Rosen, for requesting that. Nice try, guys. Come on. I see that trap. Come on. Come on, just a bit closer, mate. Oh, fuck off! There we go! <laughs> okay, it took him a second, but he eventually got there. Fuck off. Okay, see if I can bottleneck them a little bit. That looks promising. Can you guys just stop chucking things at me for five minutes? Okay. Anything useful down here? Probably not, but at least... Hark! That's on me. That is on me. Yes, if you shoot the water. Oh, I know about that. Maybe if we're coming back through here, then we can give it a try, but um, not quite yet. I 
as I still have a little ways to go and I don't want to waste too much ammo. Okay, need a key for that. Ooh, and another thing that I assume, yes, I'll need a special key for. Can you stop chucking things at me for five minutes, guys? Although, that banging noise from inside here is concerning. Come on, Leon. Put you back into it. Although I hear that mysterious ticking noise. Oh, fuck. Where are you? Closer. There we go. I don't like the sound of that. Mm. No, 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 no. No. What's that noise? Leon, do you really want to find out? Leon, does... Mm. I'm just bringing out my shotgun. Just in case. Sweetie, be honest, do you really want to go down into the dark, scary hole in the ground, or are you just now at the point in your life where you're like, you know what, how much worse can it get for me? I don't... Leon! Come on, honey! You don't want this. I don't want this. Neither of us wants this. I'm bringing up my shotgun. Mm. No, I don't want to. Hi. That hurts, you know. Seemed like you really wanted to talk. How observant, senor. Now, uh, say, uh, you gotta smoke. Priorities. You know, those things will kill you. Oh, well, maybe just don't tie me then, huh? Hi. <laughs> Not this guy. Not what guy? Oh fuck. Stop right there. Ah. No. 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 This is fine. This is fine. I'm gonna save my game. That was all one fucking chapter. <sighs> How many times did I die? Uh, okay, completion stuff. Uh, oh, only five deaths. Yay. Okay, my accuracy for my shots is 82%. That's not bad. That's not bad. Um, Because sometimes my accuracy is shit when I'm panicking, so... 
Yeah, I would count that as a solid B, maybe a B minus, considering how many times I died. Sacrificial lamb. You will receive our most sacred body. Mm. It begins now. No. <laughs> Leon? Leon, what's your safe word? I need to know now. Oh, fuck. Are you okay? Hey, stop it. Hey. Hi. You, me. Picked the wrong spot to vacation, eh? Hey, stop it. You move, I move. And I'm beat up enough as it is. I can see you're thinking. Bet you've been in spots like this before, huh? I guess. You're here looking for someone. <clears throat> One more guess. Maybe some missing senorita? Young girl. Talk. <laughs> Sorry. All right. See, her chatter about moving, senorita. Moving. Mm -hmm. Where? Who knows? But later, saw some men dragging someone <laughs> to the old church. <laughs> ah, hanging with you, not healthy. <laughs> ah. oh. You got this, boys. Hey, we're not done here. Later, amigo. Louise, you piece of shit. But I like your jacket. <laughs> shit, I took my gear. Oh, fuck off. Fuck off! Fine. Condor Hi. one to roost. I've located Baby Eagle. It sounds like she's being kept in some church. Great. That's good news. I heard it from this guy I met. Said his name is Luis Serra. There's something fishy about him. I need you to run a background check. We'll call Condor One. I'll see what I can find. In the meantime, make your way to that church. Right. I'm probably due for confession anyway. Condor One, out. The sass. I love Leon so much. Everything is fine and good and fine. Hey, how's my health actually? That's good. I'm just missing all of my shit. And yeah, was it that obvious? Um, they knew what they were doing with that scene. I know it's supposed to be oh scary. Leon's like lost all his shit and he's chained. He's chained up to the wall. How terrible! They knew what they were doing. Come on. Don't tell me they didn't know what they were doing. Yes. I have a knife. You perform wide sweeping slash attacks with right trigger. You can also de deliver quick stabs uh, again with right trigger while holding left button. I'm just going to probably be doing slashes, to be honest, because I tend to panic. Okay, then again, left bumper is more for like targeting. Mike really should be here for this. Honestly, he's been waiting for this game to come out for so long, so he might be recording his reactions to it um, for his own content, um, or he might just be enjoying it himself. Because, yeah, there's plenty of games that, like, I just enjoy just for myself and I don't want to, like, stream them or make content out of them and that. Hey, that's my gear. Hey. I'm going to get it. 
I'm going to get it. Okay. Oh yes, more herb for me. Can't I take his fucking axe or anything? Fine. Another knife. I didn't try getting through that door, so... Fuck! Um, that's a good question. I don't think Mike streams, actually. Um... I could, uh, very much be wrong, but I'm not sure he does. Or at least, like, he doesn't do a regular schedule. As far as I'm aware, I could be wrong. my health looking could be better it could also be worse I just need a little bit longer till I can get my shit back Oh, fuck off, it's timed. Okay. Yes! First try, baby. <gasps> yes. All of my things. All of my things, and all of my knives. I need a key for that. But I do have some herbs. Can I craft anything? I can make better herbs. I'm gonna do that just to free up some inventory space a bit. Um, and I'm good for bullets for now. Brown it can be used to restore some health. Okay, I'm actually just gonna have one of those. Oh, but I Leon's missing his jacket. Hey! Stranger. I know you! <sighs> We're going to become best mates. Let's do some business then, eh? Get rid of the rats that have taken up, uh, taken up in the factory. We don't know how uh, if they're carrying any diseases, but we'd rather not find out. Exterminate all the rats about in fam factory. Eh, yeah, we'll get around to it. But hello, you. Welcome. Training with the merchant. Weapons and items can be bought or sold to the merchant using uh, possessors. Um, you can also upgrade or repair your weapons and equipment. Also, apologies if I mispronounce a lot of the Spanish names and like words in this game. Um, I'm more f like familiar with a lot of with a couple of other European languages. Spanish is a language that I'm still trying to like familiarize myself with a bit. Merchant request. Once you've completed a task received from a blue request note, you can claim the reward by talking to the merchant. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. Yee. 
how long are you planning on streaming tonight, Steph? Um, maybe another half hour, 45 minutes. I want to get to like a nice, good, solid save point, if that makes sense. Ooh. Okay. What you see is what I've got. Okay, got a couple of things. Combat knife. Use key items. Key items that no longer serve a purpose can be sold to the merchant. Ruby's all rubbish. It makes no difference. The price, well, that's our choice to make. Yeah, I don't think I need that anymore, so I think I can sell that. Uh, I'm actually just going to have a little quick look. That was just locations of treasures and where is it, the village? We like our herbs, we do. Heal a man, kill a man, they do it all. <laughs> okay, what can I tune up? Oops. If you want a fighting mm. chance out there, you best tune up your kit. Okay, um... I'm going to focus for now on, firstly, I'm going to sell uh, the Hunter's Lodge key because I don't need that anymore as far as I'm aware. Hang on. I am going to sell that and I'm going to sell the ruby because I need more funds than anything else. Yes. Fix one of these beauties into a treasure, and it will fetch a price higher than the sum of its parts. Hmm. That's good to know. In that case, I might just sell the Hunter's Lodge key because I don't need that anymore. Pleasure doing business with you. You have two rubies. I do. In that case, I'll sell one and keep the other, because then if I can um, hold on to the other one. Thanks. And then uh, sell it for an even nicer price later. Then that is awesome. Knife needs care every once in a while. Could be the difference between life and death. Mm -mm -mm. A well-tuned weapon can make up for a lack of skill, friend. Oh, thank you for the hydrate check, Dork Souls. All my wares are in tip-top shape, I assure you. Um... Knife needs care every once in a while. Could be the difference between... I'm going to increase the power for that. And I'm going to increase the durability for my combat knife. Oh no, wait. Your weapons are in good hands, mate. I'll see you right. Appreciate it, mate. Um I just wasn't sure if like combat knife if that is only applicable to the knife I'm currently wielding or if it's applicable to all knives that I carry. I assume it's the latter, but that's one thing I wouldn't mind, chat, if you can clarify for me. Because, yeah, definitely increase, like, my power for uh, my SG-09. But I'm going to wait before upgrading my shotgun until I've got more funds to burn. I think you can repair it. Good point. Not seen anything you like, stranger. Hang on. Because I think you've always got your combat knife on you, unless like you lose all your weapons and armor and stuff. I think it's only for the combat knife, not any others you might pick up, like kitchen knives. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Um, in that case, I might hold off on that. A 
well-tuned weapon can make up for a lack of skew. Actually, how is my uh, combat knife doing? It's actually not doing great, so I'm actually going to pay to repair that. Good as new. And yes, I'm good with that. And then I'll hold on to these two in case I get the chance to um, uh, put them together in a treasure. Your weapons are in good hands, mate. And okay, I'm good for now. What can I do you? Trade items. I don't have any of you yet. Money can't buy. All right. Come back any time. Merchant tip: Get rich quick. How are the requests coming along? If you know, uh, did you know you can trade the spinels you receive as a reward for valuable goods that can't be bought otherwise? We've got loads of useful items, but I recommend you pick up a treasure map the most. These maps detail the locations of the cult's cherished hidden treasures. Took me and the lads a, long, a lot of time to find them. With these maps handy, you'll never be skinned again. Sure, you may have to venture into some dangerous areas to get them, but you can handle that, right? Okay. Take a look. Something's bound to catch. <gasps> oh. I'm getting a rifle soon. Good, 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 good. Save. All right. I need a s puzzle piece for that. Um. Ooh, grab you first. Okay, now that he's not wearing his jacket, I just gotta say, Leon's arms are looking amazing. The hell am I? Just, mwah, chef's kiss amazing. Okay, I think we'll keep going. I think we'll keep going tonight until we get to the next save point. Out of the way. <laughs> I love you, Leon. Oh, fuck. Okay, that's locked. That's on me. I do see those red, um... Yes, 
there we go. I just wanted to try and like conserve those just a bit. Sorry, Leon. Okay, I'm just trying to figure out where the fuck I'm supposed to go. Okay. I'm going to follow the light and... I think this is the right way. Come on, Leon, you're so close. I can't get to that box over there, so I might come back later. Come on, Leon. Okay, it allows me to go back, but it doesn't show me where the frick I'm supp supposed to go. So, let's give that another try, shall we? Okay, I have a feeling in that case I'm supposed to go further in and up. Well, that didn't last long, did it? Brilliant. Come on, Leon, you got this. You got this, honey. Come <laughs> on. 
Come on. Okay, the thing is, when I go up here and I get the gate open, it's just to go back the way I came? Am I missing something? Because, yeah, that leads back to the way I came, so I'm just going to... Because that seems to be the only thing that leads this way. So I'm just going to do what it says. Yeah, this leads back to where the merchant is, and I don't have this key. Okay, I'm just going to go quickly and save. Just in case. Because I'm kind of scratching my head a bit, like, okay, what is it that I'm Ooh, not seeing clearly? Over, Don't worry, mate, we'll be talking again very soon, I feel. I'm just going to get a little bit of healing. Before I go further. Okay, let's look at this properly. Okay, it seems like I do have to go up, from what I can tell, because there's that ladder over there. So let's head over that way. And I've cleared out most of these guys. So hopefully there isn't too many left. There we go. I think I was just so caught up in trying not to fucking die that uh, I just kept looking past it. And that's on me. It's my first time playing this, guys, so please bear with me. And I have a feeling I'll be coming back here anyway.
But at least I managed to get my way straight to where I needed to go. I need to keep an eye out for more yellow. Little bits of yellow tape in the future. <laughs> okay, this is more like it. Hexagonal emblem. Um, a hexagon shaped object with the image of a bird in flight embossed on the front. Mechanical components can be seen on the sides and back. Yes. Oh, no, wait. Oops. There we go. Just with that, I'm just gonna go save again. Uh, gun rhymes with fun for a for a reason, stranger. I like you. You're fun. Reason, stranger. <laughs> uh, actually, you know what? I've got a little bit more coin to burn. Welcome. Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. Because I've already got some healing stuff. I'm okay for now. I guarantee it. Molding a weapon to suit your specific needs. <laughs> it's a thing of beauty. My reload speed for this gun, though, is pretty slow. So I think I'm going to upgrade that. To get an idea of your tastes, and I'm not going to spend anything else. Not Don't for now. Try not to, mate. Alrighty. Oh, fuck. Fuck, that's on me. Well, I'm going to have to dip out for a lesson. Can't wait to see what you have in store for an ASMR tale to wise tomorrow to step. See you everyone Sunday, one earlier than today. Indeed. Haha. <laughs> ha. I do love it when they kind of fall into their own traps. I need to learn to shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, Sam, there's another ASMR tale coming out tomorrow. It's every second weekend. I know it's amazing how time flies, doesn't it? Also, I'm now, I took a glance over at like what I look like on stream. Do I have my super serious face on when I'm playing this game? I'm just, I'm so anxious about getting Leon hurt. He's a baby, and I love him. Nay, not as much as control. Okay, good to know. Also, these are some big ass ravens, majestic birds. Ooh. Scribbles about dolls. Their influence is not what it once was. Destroy the wind-up dolls. Do not forgive those aristocrats. Green herb. Good to know. If I see them, destroy those dolls. Uh, oh, actually. I have no shotgun shells anymore. I'm going to make some more shotgun ammo. 
It's not a lot, but it'll do in a pinch. And how am I doing for regular ammo? Actually, I'm running a little low. I'm going to make some more handgun ammo. Take this opportunity to reload. Oh, fuck off. No, 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 no. I'm trying to get you to step over. Yes. Yes! Okay. Oh my god, I did it. <laughs> oh, I am very happy with that. <sighs> I'm so stressed out by this fucking game. <sighs> okay. I count that as a victory. You can tell when my voice goes up an octave that I was very, very stressed. Ah. <laughs> I hear your sinister beeping. I have, why do I get the terrible feeling that there's going to be more of those chainsaw motherfuckers? Okay. Find another way around then. Avoiding those traps. Ah. Not a fan of how much long grass is in this game. I mean, it's great for us in stealthing around, but they hide the traps and these. I do not like that. Anything else around here? Oh, slightly nicer place. Sorry, mate. Sorry to catch you in an inopportune moment. I feel like I walked in on something. You were, you were just having some time to yourself, and um, sorry, but you were going to kill me. unlocked so I can make a quick escape if I need to. <gasps> Small key. Old photos. Interesting. Oh Demonic Aurora, it's all good. It's all good. Photo of a family, at last, flesh of our flesh, blood of our blood, give thanks and rejoice. Also, guys, we are also slowly inching towards um, hitting uh, 1,800 followers on Twitch. And as a gentle reminder, once we hit that milestone, I'll release some fun new emotes for you guys. 
And grenade. Slithers. Ooh. Something fun's gonna be in there, I just know it. I'm watching you though. Demonic Aurora, thank you so much for the 300 bits! I really, really appreciate it, thank you! Save point. A point where I can save. How's my inventory looking? It's actually doing pretty good. My knife needs repairing though. Can I actually repair my knife? Hmm, no. Okay, I'm currently just using my kitchen knife, so I'll get my combat knife repaired later. Okay. Illuminados, the 4-3. Okay, this is the first of these we've been able to uh, take a look at. In great veneration of their master, the people offered up their most prized possessions. The old farmer, his fi finest crop. The slight swineherd, his stoutest pig. The vaguely grandma, her own beloved babe. The master saw these gifts and was pleased. Okay. I have a feeling that's for the combination thing downstairs. So crop, pig, child. Okay, that's not right. So let's go downstairs. And swineherd for some reason. Yes, yes. Yes, there we go. Crystal marble. Okay, let's take a look at that. Okay. I think if I move it in a particular way, then I can make it look like something. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. And my treasures. I am watching that thing in the corner like a hawk. just hey there we go okay there has to be a particular way to do with this there we go Okay, Village Records, Volume 3, date October 10th. The weather has been strange of late. The wheat withers and the, grows, and the cows grow thin. Date, December 8th. There are signs of famine. It is true we lack the means to work the fields, but Lord Sadler's orders are absolute. Date, uh, January 30th. 30 people have starved to death. Five cows will be slaughtered. Uh, date, March 11th. The Patriarch ca gathers uh, to cast lots. Six more chosen for Lord Sadler. Uh, date, April. Eight more today. Four more today. Eleven more today. Two outsiders got lost and wandered into the village. We took them to the altar for the ritual. No need to cast lots today. Mmm. I don't like that. I don't like you. I don't like any of this! I am stressed and Leon deserves a nap. I hear something downstairs and I don't like that. Hey. 
Hey, secret door, secret door, secret door. Can I offer you a nice egg in this trying time? I would greatly appreciate that egg, and I think Leon would as well. Insignia key. Yes. Oh, fuck. But I wanted to look upstairs! Shit. Maybe I could come back here. No, fuck off, mate! I already had to deal with Mr. X's shit. I don't need you. Wait. <gasps> Is that Ada? Was that Ada? I, thought, I think that's Ada. Uh, I know that shade of red anywhere. He is the angriest puppy and he is so fucking done with this shit. <laughs> oh god. But I think honestly with that, this feels like a good time to wrap things up for tonight. Um, Because if I keep playing for another like 40 minutes or so, I'm just going to get really worn down and really tired. Because I had a bit of a long week. So this feels like a perfect time to wrap things up for the night. Ah. <sighs> uh. But thank you all so very much for joining me tonight, guys. Uh, it was a bit of a rough start at the beginning, but now that we've like figured things out um, graphics-wise, it should be smooth sailing for here on out. And I'm sure there's going to be a patch released in a couple of days as well for any initial bugs. But thank you all so, so much for joining me tonight. If you've been lurking in the shadows and you like what you've seen so far, please consider following. We would love to have you back at the Blue Rose Respite. You are welcome anytime. Be sure to check out my other socials in the chat right Right now including my twitter for important updates and other fun things my asmr tales a new one is coming out tomorrow and uh just so you guys know it is featuring a brand new character that i'm very excited about and uh my second youtube channel for my twitch vod's and my instagram for lovely pictures and be sure to check all of those out let's see who's currently streaming Hey, let's go give some love to brian and amelia over at deckard games because they are amazing and wonderful and send them lots of love from the Blue Rose Respite. And I hope you all have a fantastic weekend. Thank you so much for joining me for res uh, the first chapter of Resident Evil 4. The first two chapters of Resident Evil 4. And we'll be continuing this next Friday. And be sure to join me this Sunday for Coffee Talk. I'm very excited to see what lies ahead for that as well. But thank you all so much for joining me tonight, guys. I hope you all have a fantastic weekend. And remember, take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. And as always, stay wicked and wonderful. Good night, guys.